We're going to put them on the table for each child, okay? Okay. Braden Gertz is getting his classroom ready for the start of another school year and a new group of students. They're not just any students. They all have autism spectrum disorder. And Braden isn't just any teacher's assistant. He has it too and knows firsthand the challenges his students face. Some of the kids have issues, like they don't like talk, and uh, we're trying to help them speak. That specialized care is crucial for development. Each year we spend $11.5 billion on children with autism for everything from educational programs to medicine. But as they, as they move into the adult-based care settings, they really struggle to identify providers that are comfortable caring for them. Which is why Dr. Christopher Hanks of the Ohio State University Wexner Medical Center has helped to open one of the few clinics in the country dedicated to caring for adults with autism. Hanks says once patients like Braden move away from their pediatricians, many have nowhere to go and often fall far behind on things like checkups, immunizations, and cancer screenings. On top of that, they're using ERs more, they're using, they're needing emergency resources much more frequently. And so our hope is to provide them a place where that, that isn't the case and that they actually get the same level of care as the rest of the population. Because social interaction can be a challenge for those with autism, staff members often communicate with patients online. Beyond medical care, they also also assist with finding education and job opportunities so patients like Braden can continue to grow. There's almost a sense of relief from them having fa finally found someone that understands where they're coming from and is willing to work with them in a way that they need. At Ohio State's Wexner Medical Center, this is Clark Powell reporting.